So take notes because there's going to be a lot of stuff, I suspect. <laughs> okay. Hey, so I'd... Ali, you look angry. Look at your facial expression. Look at that. This looks like a pissed off man. This looks like a happy lady. Be smile more. That's it, basically. Let's keep going. Hello, how are you? I'm good, thank you. It's been a busy but a, a nice day, actually. Nice week, but it's always nice that it's Friday. So, uh, yeah, I'm excited about the weekend. What about on your side? Good. Be in the habit of removing annoying background stuff, your water bottle. I just see it and it's annoying, Temi. So, can you are you are you muted? I just realized I was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, cool. All right. Okay. So just, 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 just remove that. It's good. To excited for the weekend. That as always. Yeah, we'll <laughs> yeah, we can all rest actually for a bit. But it's, it's, I think it's been a good week yeah. though, at least. Yeah. Cool. So, before... better frame control, Temi. You feel like you're a reluctant leader frame control is coming in saying being more assertive and leading the agenda for the call if she was someone who was a bit more dominant she would just come in and start talking notice here there's a bit of a nervous pause i think it's been a good week yeah. at least watch yeah cool so here. Before I guess we jump into any updates, as you know, we will be sending the report for the all work done this so week. I have a like, comment. Yeah, sure, comment. go ahead. You know, one thing I don't want to do is to like cut a client when they want to speak because then it's like, am I just speaking over them? So sometimes I pause, but then I guess it also does come off like what you've just said. I do hear what you're saying though. Mm -hmm. I do like okay. feel I'll it when I am speaking. But yeah, I just don't want it to be like I'm being rude. So I'll try to give them a little bit of time to maybe they want to say something and they feel they don't know when. So I wait like, oh, is the sentence like done? But, so so yeah. so so it's good to do that. Um hey Soad, how's it going? Happy Friday. How how's your how's your week been so far? Yeah, good. How about yours? Yeah, no, really good to be honest with you. Productive, but I'm still looking forward to the weekend. I'm sure you are as well. So what I wanted to discuss today is okay. XYZ. Do you see that actually not pausing demonstrates that I am in control of what's going on as opposed to for example I'll do the same thing now but I'll pause it's um you know it's Friday so looking forward to the weekend so I'm looking forward to the weekend so I'm, I'm sure so are you so what I wanted to discuss you see the difference big mm -hmm. difference yeah because then you're gonna see that in the other call as well because I also was like it's all right it's all right I don't want to yeah right. I just didn't want it to be like I'm no, 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 no. Sorry, don't worry. I'm not going to look at the second call because that's probably going to be the pattern. If you're unaware of it, you'll do it in every call. But I've raised it to your level of conscious now, consciousness mm. now. So, so mm. it's all good. That's it. That's it. Cool. Let's keep going. Questions that you have right now before Ali gets into this week, we send that at the end of today. Are there any questions that we will be sending the report for the all work done this week? We send that at the end of today. Are there just be a bit more specific by the time before you leave the office today. Because then she has a sense of timeline. Oh, I leave the office at six. I don't like this before end of day stuff that people, because Sebastian uses that as a fucking reason to send people shit at 10 p.m. I'm like, mate, most clients don't check stuff at 10 p.m. So just be mindful, get into the habit of, oh, so Ad, I'm going to send you the report within two hours. Just stuff mm. like that's much better because there can be like, oh, I had mm. the meeting at one, so kind of by three, I'll get it. Cool. That's how people think. It's easier to get into the habit yeah. of stating a specific time. Any questions that you have right now before Ali gets into any particular update or yeah? Okay. Are there any questions that you have right now at at the end of today? Are there any, any updates? As you know, we will... before I guess we jump into any updates. As you know, we will be sending the report for the all work done this week. We send that at the end of today. Are there any questions that you have right now before? Ali get into any particular update or yeah yeah um before the updates i wanted to tell you guys that we have some like uh like uh, carla came back to me about the prepod um m site for ida landing page okay and um she would like to change some stuff for example when we scroll on the mobile um it should be like for example for each project it should be like a different uh for example slide like it opens but it doesn't uh like there's no line like we can i said it should, should fill the page is that what you mean yeah exactly like yeah. you don't see the page before or you slide up to see yes. the page before but you okay. don't see the separation okay Ali, if we you could got that do that yes cool, cool cool makes sense and 
also if for like uh like I, we can implement this when it's live but we can add for example ida amenities before all of the amenities okay um let, let sure, sure. By the way, can, is it possible for you to really show us on your desktop you can just write also ask it yeah, yeah, yeah to show you uh mobile okay i'll show you like on the desktop what like should be changed but only for mobile yeah i'll i'll, I'll show you where to do that so let's okay let's show How do you just share the screen? And Look, I, I, yeah. Okay, a couple of things. So number one, I know that you're going to probably open up. Um, is it the console in Chrome and show her how to do the mobile part, Ali? I don't know if that's what you're going to show her, but I'll go through a couple of points. So number one, when people say Carla was saying X Y Z, immediately say, "Oh, amazing! Is it okay, Soad, if you just..." record a quick video on your phone and just narrate exactly what you see that you like to change. Is that okay to do that? That'd be brilliant. Go ahead, Temi. Yes, we actually did end up saying that after she explained all this. I know, I know. Do it immediately. Do it immediately. Yeah. Do it just immediately. Okay. C coach the client to give video based feedback. Um, and just, just she'll, she'll say, cool. I'll also tell you now. I said, absolutely amazing. I'll just be honest with you. There's a possibility that we might misinterpret you know what 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 you're telling us because we just might have a different sense of it and it might end up slowing things down so tell me anyway but is it okay to just record the video um if you want to record the video right now if it only takes two minutes just record it literally right now i can i can wait and then she might just record the video in front of you be like oh this that da, 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 da. and then she just sends it boom in the group so i would do it if it's gonna be less than a two minute video i'd literally say why don't you just just summer feel free to do it right now we can wait cool all right all right so 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 that's the first thing the second thing is ali you're really rude unintentionally with how you say what you say she is confused about how to share your screen you say just share the screen like she's an idiot listen i'll show you we have to do that so let's okay let's share how do you how she's trying to say now how do you share screen okay that's what she's trying to say now you say just share the screen just share the screen so does it do, do you understand what i'm saying that would be something that you wouldn't say in this context i'd be like just turn your camera on if someone was mm -hmm. like oh how do i how do i turn my just turn your camera on you'd be like oh whoa calm down dude i'm getting there so just be mindful of that how do you just share the screen Look, I, I, yeah, I yeah okay cool Sorry, nope. you know where the share screen button is just yeah. okay okay you got there in the end both of you but it took too long to get to it it was very clear what the problem was immediately you wanna assume yeah. that you... okay, what so what you want to say is oh you should see even when i'm speaking like a green bar going up and down where the mic is just next to that there's a share button can you see it be like, oh yeah okay i see it now so just 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 spoon feed people like that because that will continuously come up i'm sure you've had that happen before so just manage it in the same way can you guys see? No, oh, no, no, it's not sharing to us yet. It's not sharing? No, no. Okay. Yeah, it's saying impossible to share. Um, you know what you could do alternatively is maybe just record your screen and then just send it to us on WhatsApp just so we can see where yeah, you're printing. Oh, screenshot. Better, exactly. I can maybe like just uh, or like uh, do like a uh, recording on my phone yeah. so it's the end mm -hmm. site and so we can like I can show you what she doesn't want. Yeah, that's that that that's what we don't want to have happen. She had to make the suggestion that was obvious. We make the suggestion, not she. Uh, just you know, the same thing because you said, "Oh, we got there in the end." She got there kind of in the end because the share screen uh, screen didn't happen because she's giving the ideal solution. You're saying, "I'll oh, just record a uh, video," but I don't think you mentioned mobile. Just so we can see. Um... Hmm. You know what you could do alternatively is maybe just record your screen and then just send it to us on WhatsApp just so we oh, can see where you're from. I stand corrected. Exactly. You're I can right. maybe like just uh, right. or like uh, do like a uh, recording on my phone yeah. so it's the end site and so we can like I can show you what she doesn't want. Of course, no, yeah, yeah. Okay. just yeah. just explain really fast. So basically, this line she wanted to like go up as a slide, like we can't see mm. the one before. Portions, the portion. exactly. So one portion. If I just slide it a bit, the other portion should appear. Exactly. The other short portion. So it shouldn't be as slide slide. It should be you know switch. Exactly, kind of switch from like one yeah. part to another. And yeah. for this one, which is the amenities that just changes, uh, the first slide only on the mobile side. I understood. 
I'll uh, say either amenities. Okay, so uh, yeah, I understood. Let's, uh, I'll, I'll, okay. after this meeting, so, so Ali, one of your big verbal ticks, I think that you need to, if you're going to do a lot more client facing stuff, is just working on the, you're very f efficient, but you need to just practice little things to be friendlier. You sh it would have been better there to say, okay, thanks. That makes sense. Instead of, okay. Duh, 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 duh. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I should be smoother. Do you hear that? Okay. Yeah. You, I should go both. With smooth talk. Yeah. Both just you, you, okay. Thank you. Amazing. That's great. Fantastic. Oh, I appreciate that. Oh, I see where you're coming from. That is not really a part of your vocabulary. You're okay. Got it. Cool. Fine. Yeah. Go ahead, Temi. I'm actually going to say something that I just say now, actually, after the debug had not necessarily pointed out to me, but I picked up on how you speak is just saying, okay, fantastic. Even if it's like not something you use, so I think just make it part of how you speak. Because when people give suggestions like this, or when they say, oh, we wanted to update you, instead of just saying, okay, cool, you say, okay, amazing, fantastic. Okay, thanks for the update. Then it like becomes so normal that even if Deepak had to speak to me now, I'd just be like, okay, amazing. Or fantastic, sounds good, you know, things like that. So it, it might maybe feel a bit uncomfortable in the beginning because if that's not how I speak, because that was never how I spoke. If I didn't say fantastic or amazing, I didn't speak like that. But now to clients, because they constantly give updates and they obviously also want to see that, you understand what they're saying. We don't just say, okay, I understand. Or I understood. It sounds very like military almost. So you're like, I understood. Got it. Yeah. You say fantastic. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Even the way we speak yeah. to our team members, I don't know if you ever see me and say, also just say, amazing. Thank you so much. Or fantastic guys. Sounds great. Just, yeah, you can maybe practice with our own team members rather than even. Yeah, that's all. <laughs> so what I'll do is I'll, I'll practice it this weekend so that, I have something ready for for something. Yeah, you, so you, you, you could have you could have said it literally just then. You could have said amazing. What I'll do this weekend. All good. <laughs> you, you could you, you could even do it again right now. You're like, oh, I see. I've got it. Yeah, that makes sense. Thanks, man. Um, it's again to be. I can tell it's super unnatural for you, but the only yeah. way is practice. But cool, fine. You've got a process. Let's keep going. I should uh, tell, uh, say, either amenities. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I understood. Let's, uh, I'll, I'll, okay. after this meeting, uh, create a video and set it in the group so that Amit understands it as well. Yeah, fully, yeah. Okay. Yeah, these, these points noted. Okay, great. I'll do it. Like, I'll uh, record everything and uh, explain. Okay. Yeah, uh, and I have a question for you as well, if you don't have any. No, that's it for now. Yeah, I, I wanted to understand uh, about the Loom. Have you no, that's it for now. My phone, yeah. so it's the M side, and so we can like I can show you what you do. It's not sharing. No, no. So let's. Okay. You don't see the page before, or you slide up. These yeah. points noted. Uh, about the the global or the uh, about the okay. yeah, uh, and I have a question for you as well. If you don't have any. No, that's it for now. Yeah, I, I wanted to understand uh, about the Loom. Have you watched the Loom, by the way? That's yes, so the Loom for the global, like uh, the global or the. Yeah, the way that you speak, you really sound like you're her boss. You need to sound like you are colleagues, not her boss. So it's like, oh, did you manage to watch a loom by any chance? Instead of, have you watched a loom? It's, it's, so you sound too instructive or didactic rather than like, yeah. So, so you just, the, the language just work for you specifically, Ali. I know it's, that'll be the bigger piece for you. I record everything and, no, that's, that's yes, yeah, so the loom for the global. Like uh, the global or the one with the leads, the problem. The leads, the leads one. Yes, yeah, I actually watched it. It's so, um. So the thing is, uh, <laughs> let me just brief you a bit. Sorry, the thing is, it's working for me when I am doing it from UK. Even the UTM ID is coming up. It's like in specific locations, it doesn't, it doesn't work, and uh, it might be that due to some cache issue outs as well on the person's mobile or on person's computer laptop, it doesn't work. So there's something interfering, but from my side, from from web development perspective, it's 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 working fine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, it's because uh, she showed me that, like mentioning, when she goes on Salesforce. Okay. Okay. They... okay. Problem solution. Problem solution. You're just saying it's your problem. You need to give several solutions, Ali, with whatever you say. Uh, obviously, aside from interrupting her and that being quite rude, so rude that Temi laughed and he said, "Oh, sorry." So you need to do a lot of work on how you communicate because she might walk away from that call saying, oh, I don't really like working with Ali. He's quite rude. 
and I don't enjoy the way he communicates with me. It'd be a logical, valid thing for her to say to her team, her to go back to when these fucking other guys complain about us, saying, well, also their team are a little bit rude. Temi's lovely, but when Ali speaks, and Ali's probably doing most of the speaking because it's technical stuff, it's like he's my fucking boss, but we're paying him. How does that make any sense? So have you done this? Don't know that. And he interrupts me when I'm speaking. Um, and then he says, sorry, and Temi laughs like it's, it's a bit weird. I don't like the relationship I have with that guy. Um, he reminds me of some of the Arab men that we have here that are very rude and we're getting an international company and that's not really, that's why we're not getting a local company. I'm stereotyping now, you know what I fucking mean when I say that, but I could build up that argument and I could present this call and I could say, yeah, look at the evidence. He interrupts. He kind of doesn't know when to say sorry. So, so work aggressively on that Ali and it will help your communication. It works the way that you communicate. I know in South Asia, because I, you know, family in India and Pakistan, but as you go abroad, don't do that because that's where people can, that's one of the, by, by the way, that's one of the big reasons that Charles gets upset with the, 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 the all of the Pakistani and Indian team, because people don't realize that they're sometimes rude. So I have to they'll often send Charles a message and I'll DM, I've DM'd a lot of people saying, guys, Charles is 54. It's your third day here. And you're talking to him like you're his boss. You don't fucking do that. And people, but, but people don't do it intentionally because of the cultural difference in India and Pakistan. Does that make sense? But that doesn't carry over. But in every economy, almost every economy, I've yet really to understand, to see where it doesn't work. Being polite works fucking everywhere. <laughs> like it just works everywhere um so 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 working on that and then also as you teach the others because one of the ways that you can learn is you can try and teach something that you're still learning to the rest of the pakistani team so guys when you communicate with deeper or when you communicate you've got to use words like please thank you amazing i appreciate it i've got it and and all of that type of stuff because you're like you think these words are unnecessary but you it, it means a lot so 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 just something for you to be mindful of they don't show everything as well, but he's not agreeing. So I anyway, let's just go to your video, Temi, alone, because it's most mostly Ali. And I think the work for you, you know what you need to work upon, Ali. So I won't continue. Before we move to, yeah, go ahead, Temi. Honestly, Ali, we can also just role play for like 10 minutes every other day, honestly, like maybe three times a week. Yeah, yeah. And we can just practice helpful. back and forth. Yeah, Thanks. I'm happy to do that. Yeah, cool. Your key I was about to literally learn. Sorry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, so your key takeaways, Ali, what are they? Now, now, Ali, a, a distinction. And that, that's sometimes a problem. People sometimes mirror me. But the way that I am sometimes often with clients can be quite different to the the way that we are internally. There's there's quite a big distinction of behavior. So people think that Deepak, oh, um, but the way that you talk with me isn't quite the same. I'm paying you. They're paying me. So the relationship behavior changes. Um, so that's just a something for you to to be mindful of. That because because everyone, almost everyone sees me in an internal room, but that's not always and often a reflection of how I am with clients. It sometimes is with certain clients I might interrupt them, but 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 not 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 always. So anyway, what are your key takeaways, Ali? That's what I wanted to ask. I think the biggest would be I need to make sure to be smooth in the way I talk. I take my time as well. Don't be in rush because I see that it's like I'm in rush. Okay, let's get this done and let's move on. So that's one. Number two is I need to make sure and I'll I'll, I'll work on it that I use correct words in terms of thank yous and fantastic and okay, it sounds good. And so on. it's it's like, it's not part of my nature, as you say, or oh, my culture. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be something that's gonna take maybe a week or two or maybe a month with practice. I'll try and get on calls with guys and then with with, with Temi as well. But yes, I, I get it when I see it. So it's, it's sometimes that when you see yourself, you realize the amount of mistakes that you make. And I see more than what you saw. So it was like, there is a lot of things that I need to work on. Okay. What else did you see? 
I saw my, the way I, you know, like this, it's, it's not cool. Why are you like this? Okay. Okay. Uh, Oh, you my, mean when my, you scratch my, when you scratch your back yeah. and then you do this, yeah, my, your your expressions really really work to, as well. Yeah, so I need to basically sit and be ready and take the toll smoothly and and politely make making sure I focus as as well. So I think the biggest thing is the focus, but out of those focuses, these things also come. So yeah, that would be all. Okay, 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 okay. All right, perfect. Um. That will be all is an expression a teacher often uses with their student. So you need to get rid of that expression from your vocabulary as well, unless you're leading a call. I would never say to a client, and that will be all. So that does it, does that make sense what I'm saying, Ali? So certain expressions to drop as well. Um, so get rid of that one also, because I know that you use that one. Practice not using I use it. Teacher, so I think that that's the reason. Sorry, say again? I used to be a teacher in an international school, so that might be the reason I have gotten this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all good. It's, it's all good. It's, it's, it's... Actually, I think... Uh, oh, sorry, I'm interrupting again. Sorry. That's okay. Go ahead. Actually, I think the reason that I have these issues is because, I, as you said, as you said right now, that people try to mirror me and because I didn't see myself and I need to really see myself talking this way, I would un I would be able to better understand my mistakes. And I never did this practice. That's why I'm I'm, I'm this in this pitfall, honestly. So I should try and, and audit myself. Well, look, I think that you've probably never been on a call like this where we go through a call recording and watch a playback. And that's to a degree and it's uncomfortable which is why people don't do it and and, and obviously it, it, it's it's people don't uh, see it as I a like priority it. but but it's useful yeah yeah okay cool great so there's lots of takeaways for you which is great now let's just dive into your call temi we won't spend too much longer hello hello how are you doing oh you sound fucking like you're on drugs or you're bored temi <coughs> hello how are you doing hello how are you doing Listen to hey hey how's it going hey hey Carl how you doing morning hey Carl afternoon listen 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 back now in context of what I've said hello hello listen to his hello energy mirroring energy listen to your energy how are you doing you get it now you get it yeah cool. That's it. Let's continue. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I hear what right, you're saying. You didn't back okay. in the moment. You're not hearing that. It's okay. It's okay. Mm -hmm. I'm good. Thank you. I've had a. I would say a busy morning, but it's still been good. You've had a bad morning. It's all written all over your face. You've got to be able to hide your expressions. Look at your face. Hi, right, Timmy. How are you? Watch now. I'm good. Thank you. I've had a. There. Boom. You see it? I've had a. Oh, so you've not had a good morning then, have you? Because, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Everything's good. It's Friday. Looking forward to the weekend. But excited about our call today because I've got some really cool updates to share with you, Carl. Versus, uh, yeah, I've had a good, I've had a good week. You'd be like, but what happened? Did you, did you drop the baby on Wednesday, but it was better by Friday? Was it that kind of week? I would say a busy morning, but it's still been good though. What about you? Okay. How was your holiday time away? Uh, it was, the holiday was amazing, but then I came back and I was sick as a dog for about three days. Like, I literally couldn't leave bed sick. I've, I've only yeah. just today, just today been about three days. Like, I literally couldn't leave bed sick. I've, I've only yeah. just today, just today, dog for about three days. Like, I literally couldn't leave bed sick. I've, I've only yeah. just today. What did you say there? Really? That's, I don't even know what I said, actually. I'm thinking of, I think I'm thinking, I don't know. I'm going to be honest. Get there. What about you? Okay. How's your holiday time away? Uh, it was, the holiday was amazing, but then I came back and I was sick as a dog for about oh, three no. days. Oh, no. I literally completely oh, bed sick. Damn, I'm I've, so I've only sorry. Just today, just today, been able to um, keep food down. So well, that's well, a nice well, story I'm, for you. Um, but yeah, the, the holiday was nice. We only went to, it was my partner's 30th birthday. Mm. Uh, so Happy I, I birthday. Kind of did, like a little trip. We have a little dog. And um, we, 
it, we did like a surprise trip because she thought nice. her family, her and her family are really close. And she yeah. thought that we kind of hadn't arranged okay. anything because they cool. always do big family holidays for these big moments and her sister's slightly older and you know, ah, we did the same thing. Okay. Um, so me and her mum had been talking since kind of Christmas and said, nice. so both of us say, we haven't planned anything. We haven't got any holiday time. We haven't got any time off. So okay. then on the Thursday before we went away, I uh -huh. booked a, like a week off for her. I said, Good we're going to go away for your birthday. We're going to go to Cornwall, which is a place that she really wants. Are you getting it? I'm actively yeah, listening. Well, you're, you're, yeah. you're, I'll keep doing it just for, he'll rap soon, but yeah, active listening, your biggest thing. Mm -hmm. It's just going to be me, you and Miko, uh, who's our dog, but yeah. oh. your mum is sad that, you know, they can't come and she went and called her mum and was like, am I not seeing you on my birthday? This is disgusting. <laughs> you did all this stuff for Katie. Like, do you not love me? And Where are your mum? Who's her mum almost broke and was like, oh, I, don't, I don't know what to do. I don't know what yeah. to do. Do I say anything? Oh, but gosh. what the plan was, by the time we arrived at Cornwall, her mum and her mm. dad and her sister and her uh, brother-in-law were all yep. ready waiting for us there. And so nice. they did this big surprise. She had lots of tears and then oh. we spent the, the week together. So it was, it was oh. really nice. Cornwall's like yeah. a, a really beautiful part of the world that she's always really? wanted to go. So she got okay. everything she wanted. So it was really lovely, but it just took us eight and a half hours to get there in the car, and it took ah. ten and a half to get back. I mean, it was worth it though. Like, if I'm yeah. really honest, <laughs> so it's okay. Just a little bit of, I'd say, time sacrifice, if you can call it that. And then yeah. it was all worth it. That sounds really lovely. I'm glad you had a good time. It was oh, lovely, but then how was yeah. it lovely? Honestly, it's been work and work. Oh, but last, it? Yeah, last week Friday, I took off. I yeah, just needed to rest a little bit, so I spent the weekend just literally just Chill. yeah, yeah, like trying to <laughs> not think too much. And I sat and I was watching. Um, I don't know if you know Love Island. I was watching that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Which yeah. one are you watching? <laughs> are you watching the British the, one? The, I started watching the UK one, and now I'm watching the USA one. But the USA um, one's finished. The I prefer. See, I am. Um, my ex partner used to go nuts for this. We used to have yeah. like big parties for all of our friends around here, and it became this huge event. All my friends, but yeah. um, I'd always fall asleep. So entertaining though. It's, but the US one. <laughs> so, yeah, it's like it's like the best. They made lots of money from it this the season. Yeah. The season. Have, but... you, have, have you ever watched Maths? Married at First Sight. No, I haven't. I think that's on. Okay. That's the channel that it plays on. I don't even know what's the name of, of it. Um, I don't know what it's. I, I can't think of it right now. But I don't watch that though. No. But I watch a lot of yeah. reality dating. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So maths. The only the school to like. Jesus are we going to Christ? This guy talks about fucking nonsense, doesn't he? Yeah, well, they're just there because they want to so entertain. You... It's brutal. It... <laughs> yeah, I watch in your business. I'm, actually, I'm like... watching my soaps, and he has. You're, no comment, by the way. This is all great. It was just the opening that was um, mm, a bit. A I bit... can see the difference. No, no enjoy like eating something. I believe that. No, like I love literally. That. At the edge of the sofa, fourth one is in with a bucket of popcorn and like a blanket over and going, God, can you believe that? No, like literally, that. that's exactly that. Like I saw that real time. But yeah, like, <laughs> funny. that's accurate, it's accurate. But yeah, okay, cool. I mean, that was, it's nice to know that you watch those things. It's like my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> and well, um, yeah. I, I, wanted, just, I, can, yeah. I wanted to just start from this, just to say that okay. I know that I, I, I wanted to kind of be quite trying. Who is this guy? Oh, Jay Wing. He's, oh, right. Oh, yes, okay. I was going to say. I don't even know who is that, Can I have a comment quickly? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so I was I kept thinking like at what point do I just like say, okay, I want to give you updates, but you can see here he started to jump straight into the work as I was about to be like, okay, so I wanted to, and then he also said I wanted to, and then I was like, Oh, okay, but I didn't want to interrupt him. So I was like, okay, then he had he jumped into the work conversation. Yeah, yeah. So that was the other thing I was thinking about when you said I should speak and then also kind of direct uh, it towards Yeah, yes. yeah. I would just wrap small talk up sooner that's all whenever it's my mm. turn to speak i would say yeah no so i watched it and i've not seen uh, you know and this yeah i thought it was really great so what i wanted to talk to you about today transition mm. so so but but um you of course let the conversation play out because you're concerned about pleasing the client and you want to be agreeable and be nice which we've discussed anyway and it's just about stepping in a bit sooner to do the frame control piece so that for mm. example is part a bit more part of ali's nature where he likes to just say this is what we're going to do and he'll interrupt but the other side of that is that he can come across as rude at times and that's the counterbalance so there's different pieces for obviously you both to work upon both of you need mm. to actively listen when it comes to a client telling a story or saying something and the best way, in my view, is to actively comment whilst people are talking. I, I, I think that that's good because it's a higher okay. form of demonstrating that I'm actually listening to what's going on. Um, so, so, mm. but, but, but obviously, but anyway, anyway, um, but cool. Let's let let he's gonna complain now, isn't he? So let's let's listen. I just, I wanted to start from this just to say that I know that I I, I wanted to kind of be quite transparent i have i feel like because of coming into this role having to get to grips with the role with the product with everything else I, this has kind of been maybe at the back of my mind for a lot of 
So just a small thing. I mean, this is a bit more advanced, but just do you see your facial expression? That's one of fear. It's a micro expression that you have there. So so I see it and I sense it and I'll show you more examples of it. <laughs> and um, well, yeah, I wanted, just, I, just, yeah. I wanted to start from like there, of course, like a big one. It's, like, it's very close to, can you guys see me? Yes, 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 yes. Oh, okay, mm -hmm. all right, let me, let me let me make myself a bit bigger so it's easier. Uh, there you go. So yeah, it's like, it's like, okay, yeah. So that's kind of, so hang on, let's just listen. Okay, to see just to say going. that I know that, I, I wanted to kind of be quite transparent. I... And look, look at, look at, look, you've got your eyebrows up now, right? Look at my eyebrows. Mm. And I, that's what mm. kind of, this is not, but, but that's what kind of dogs do. Like what you want to do is furrow your eyebrows because then you look like you're focused. So, okay, talk to me about the problem. <laughs> hmm. 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 Don't worry about it at all. It's going to be fine. Eyebrows up. Okay. Is surprise and fear. Eyebrows down is focus. Does that make sense? It does make sense. Yes. Yeah. yeah cool. So just it's a small mm. thing, but his eyebrows are down because he's focused on what he's going to say, and he's going to say something that's that that that, that you know. Oh, I think that we need to do this. It's not. It's something that's neutral, neutral to negative, but it's also a good way to focus. Your eyebrows are mm. up because there's kind of fear and anxiety. So they're the general rules of thumb. Does that make sense? People raise their eyebrows like, oh, whoa, yeah. calm down, man. I'm shocked. So it's just the eyebrow play. I have, I feel like because of coming into this role, having to get to grips with the role, with the product, with everything else, I, this has kind of been maybe at the back of my mind for a lot of okay. this time. Okay. And I realized this, to be honest with you, when I was ill Monday, no, Tuesday, and I was thinking to myself, I haven't given you the time, the resources, really a lot of anything, which is not good. I feel like it's not good enough for me. And it's not how I would like us to pro progress. That's okay. Don't worry. No problem. By being silent, you acknowledge that he's mm -hmm. fucked up. I don't know if I said anything after this, but do you like? I understand what you mean. Like while they're still talking, it's let's see. Let's see. Yeah, yeah. That's why I silent. It, when someone's silent, yeah. it's acknowledgement that you agree with them, right? Mm, that's yeah. legal that that's legally binding in contractual law by the way so if i say temi i'm going to for example mm -hmm. cut your grass and you i give you you give me five pounds or whatever mm -hmm. or you don't and then you just look at me and then i start cutting your grass there's a contract there even if you haven't said mm -hmm. anything because it's that whole thing about silent. If you're silent, but you're witness to something, but you don't say something, it means that you're agreeable yeah. to it. So, so that's why it's um, important. It's really a lot of anything. I want us, and I do like that we're on WhatsApp together, but I would like us almost to be co-workers, essentially. Yeah, I yeah, don't yeah, want, and, and which I don't think, because of everything else I've had going on, I don't think I've been able to give you the time. However. Do you see, you don't actually say anything. You agree. Mm, By not saying okay. something, you're saying, yeah, you're right. You, you, you have been a bit of shit. You can't, yeah, you're kind of right. You haven't given me enough time, but it's okay. So, do you, do you understand so if i say yeah Timmy, i'm so sorry that i didn't send you that report you know what like my dog mm. died etc and stuff like that i'm exaggerating now but imagine you say yeah you don't say anything and you're like okay i understand i understand it's a bit like oh okay she's meant to fucking be like yeah oh goodness she's meant to forgive me we forgive the client mm. even if we don't really mm. forgive them but we forgive the client i'm now at a stage where Just that's like, not the case mm. Yeah, in my brain, I was I wanted to see like, okay, where is this going? But I see how it comes off. Like, he's saying, "I'm sorry for being A, B, and C," and I'm just like, and it looks like I'm saying, "Yes, you were that way." I do see it. Yeah, but yeah. So yeah, yeah in the yeah. moment, I'm not having those thoughts, but it will be more apparent going forward. Yeah, it's okay. Because of everything else I've had going on, I don't think I've been able to give you the time. However, I'm now at a stage where that's not the case. I feel like I'm on top of everything. Yay! What we're doing now is I wanted to inform Amazing. you of one thing, but I just wanted, I suppose I wanted to start this off just kind of with like a little bit of an apology to say, no, don't, okay. don't take the last like three weeks as um, kind of like a, a way that I work. It's now we will always wonder if he said, I want to apologize because he was thinking she's fucking not getting that she should say it's okay. Oh goodness. So do I have yeah, to make yeah. it super explicit? Because he would not probably say that. Or he might say that, but there's a chance he wouldn't mm. if you, along the way. Um, yeah. It's not. It's just that it's been hectic. And I've had that with my partner's 30th, and then it was sick. But moving forward, I would like this to be a lot more collaborative. So what I wanted to start off by saying was, whatever you need from me, so the copy, I know I still haven't bloody sent you. Anything else, I want to get that done today. So that if there's, it's on my list today, Tony. Amazing.
Not of course. Amazing. I want to get you that all to you today. Of course. Of course you fucking should. Amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I've got two things written down. Into that mm. to make three calls, which are to three organisations that I need to speak to and sort of So, what after this? What would be really nice for me if you could just drop me an email or a WhatsApp, either. Okay, that's it. I, I don't like the way that you respond in terms of how you manage his replies. It's just so that's it. That's the main takeaway for me, Timmy. Yeah. The, the, it's it's um. Do, do, do you start talking at some point? Yes, of yes, yes, yes. I was gonna say so, course, but yes, I did start speaking. But I wanted him to first explain what you wanted to explain. Okay. And then yeah. I want to let me know when you can see this slide. Yes, oh, I can. For fuck's sake, okay, cool. Yeah. So, what and uh, sell and over to you're struggling to get hold of, add it to a list. What needs to be done? Okay, here we get go. Hold of, that you can see the organic place one and they're serving a sponsored ad. Send that okay. list to me. If okay. it's from yourself or from your team, you can collate it. We can do it every two weeks. But whenever you want to do it, I can gather that data for you. I can put it into that nice, neat format that shows you the key bits that you need to say. I can send email it straight across to you. You can just regurgitate it on the phone. You won't have to do anything. I'll do all the work they sent. Okay, okay. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, thank you. I really appreciate that. That That's that's fantastic. I'll do all the work. Your team doesn't do nothing. Oh, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. You're like, okay, okay, that makes sense um it's like no it fucking doesn't say thank you um so 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 um eat your own dog food because what you mm -hmm. said to ali just now you're not really consistently doing yourself if that makes sense yeah i see yeah i yeah, see yeah, yeah. for you i can put it into that nice need to do anything in alignment with what needs to be done okay 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 that makes sense i have to run that by the when you pause okay that makes sense it sounds like it doesn't fucking make sense. Does it make sense? Yes, because I was also mid thought, just wondering if this is something we can do. So that was I know, something I, I know, to... I know that you yeah. don't think it was rude. Of course, I know that, but you got to practice not pausing. Mm. If Ali says, "I'm so sorry, I'm late because my had a power cut," and said, "Okay, that makes sense." I would probably he would probably think I don't think Deepak believes me. Mm. Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah into that nice neat format that shows you look look so uh, I'll, I'll, it's fine i'll wrap there um that's fine so so, so um what are your key takeaways Sammy? first of all is frame control and then knowing when to i would say knowing when to have the small talk and then knowing when to end it so it obviously doesn't go long because i guess some people like him have a lot to say and it's like great but we can also keep it a little bit shorter and then while people are talking, also just showing that I'm actively listening. Even if I am, it shouldn't just be me like nodding the whole time and not responding because like you said in this particular situation or maybe even with so I, they potentially things that they expect me to maybe reassure them or make them feel like, no, you're not giving us issues. You're literally not a problem. Everything is fine. And thank you for saying what you're saying because he was apologizing. I shouldn't just nod and wait to see where he's going with it. And while he's talking, I should actively be like, yes, no, it's perfectly fine or yeah good thank you so much for telling me any you know those words so i guess there are times i actively can tell that i'm saying okay amazing and then other times i don't think to say that and now i see it when i'm watching it back i'm like i thought i said it way more than like what um there's certain situations where it just doesn't cross my mind and i guess here yeah, because i was nervous about what he was going to say just you when you were explaining to me sorry i'm not saying takeaways but quickly when you're explaining to me my facial expressions, I'm like, you're kind of describing exactly what happened in this moment where you're like, yeah, you look scared because he said, oh, I wanted to tell you. And I was like, oh, no, are you going to say we're going to stop working with you? And then he just was like, oh, this is the new plan that we thought would be good. That's yeah. the whole call. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah but my, my takeaways were the frame control. Being an active listener, as well as not just taking pauses or even if there's something that I'm considering that I should ask the team, I shouldn't make it seem as if I'm confused now or thinking in the moment. Otherwise it comes off like I'm unsure or I don't think that what he's saying is good or makes sense. So I don't want the client to feel like, was I saying something stupid? And she was like, what, what the fuck? So even in the moment I should be like, okay, no, thank you. And then afterwards be like, I don't know. Or can someone please explain this to me? Yes. Rather that. So just, yeah, those were my takeaways. I think there is a lot though. And one thing I'm trying not to do is also like look to the side because it's not even like I'm looking at my, that wasn't something you pointed out, but I do see it when I'm speaking. I'll be like, okay, or something like that. I don't want to do that. I want to like look at the person that I'm speaking to the whole time. Because then I think I sometimes feel like, um, um, and I see it. And I'm like, I hate that. I just want to talk. So, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Really comprehensive feedback. Ali you want to on your journey develop that level of comprehensive feedback in terms of all of the points because it's a great way to 
for me and for you to understand, to articulate the full depth of your understanding, if that makes sense. And 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 this stuff now, guys, is the more advanced level of communication. Ninety percent of the team are not capable of this anyway. It will just blow their fucking mind, and they're being capable of doing it. But but this is the journey that we, the path that we need to walk. So the only other recommendation I have outside of your practice is you should schedule at least once a week the challenging journey of watching one of your own videos to just observe yourself just five minutes mm -hmm. and you'll see because we fool ourselves that's the way that we're biologically mm -hmm. designed to think we're here when really we're there that's why Literally. athletes watch game tape so athletes professional mm -hmm. but professional athletes watch playback of the games that they play in to mm. see all of the things that they didn't see they were doing in the moment where the coach would say look look cristiano do you see there where you're like oh wow i thought that but i see now that i made the mistake and i didn't see that guy and and this and that so analyzing game tape is is, is really important when it comes to calls yeah so just schedule a meeting with yourself for five ten minutes each week and watch playback and and, and you'll you'll see many things that you didn't realize were happening in real time that is true i think also sometimes yeah. i have this expect that like I, have, I know i express a lot of what i'm thinking on my face but in moments i should need to actually you need to hide it what i'm doing you need to get better yeah. at hiding it you need to even if you're shitting yourself you need to display supreme control and confidence the whole time yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. it's gonna it's, be a challenge but i am i am course. as long as you're aware of something you can of course not to yeah yeah, yeah. today was a conscious it. today was a consciousness call you have gone from being inconscious, unconsciously incompetent to consciously incompetent with some yeah. aspects of the call and the rest with your the mindset that you both have, you'll begin to fix by yourself. I, I don't probably need to tell you much more than do what you need to do to do the work. So mm -hmm. that's it. I'll give it one week when you've had okay. a couple more meetings and then we can review a new call to see what progress has been. That sounds good. Sounds good. Yeah, cool. Any questions? I have mm -hmm. yeah, a me question too. that's not related to this, though, but just quickly one that I had. Okay, about one second. The... So for those of you, if I do ever put this on YouTube, thank you sure. and good night.